If you have stoneware in your home, there's a good chance it came from a Minnesota couple. Lucy and Jean Tokheim began making pottery 45 years ago. What started as a few pieces here and there has turned into a cross-country business. And this week's Finding Minnesota, we go to Latke Parl County, where the pottery wheel never stops spinning. It is very peaceful out here. It's, I love the quiet, I love the night skies. If artists need space to be creative, then it's mission accomplished for Jean and Lucy Tokai. <laughs> Serenity for the couple can be found in the western Minnesota countryside, and even during a spring snowstorm, the commute to work isn't half bad. Not at all. <laughs> I only have, you know, 50 feet to walk. That's by design. The Tokheims don't like to be far from a studio filled with stoneware, crafted with a Scandinavian touch. It was just the right thing for me. I loved it. 45 years ago, Jean took a pottery class in college and never looked back. But for the first 20 years, business was slow, especially while trying to raise three boys. Unlike the fire in a kiln, there was nothing surefire about their future. What changed your mind? Well, we, sa we started to make a living, you know? So then it was like, I guess I was wrong. I guess we can make a living here. And not just a living, an international influence. The Tokheims have sold stoneware to people in all 50 states and to pottery collectors worldwide. You said these are for drinking beer? Right. So you sell a lot of those then? We do. Everything from mugs to bowls to cups to water pitchers. This is to get the air pockets out of it. It starts with Gene. Between these fingers and lifting it. And that's the part that looks like magic. He's throwing clay with a foot behind the wheel. This is how he likes to roll. You can't really tell someone how to do that. They just have to do it. Just pull that spout down. It's bringing it down just like a gooseneck. It's gotten to the point that Gene can look at a pitcher and make the next one almost exactly the same with the Tokheim's logo on every piece. And there I have the reindeer logo, the date, 2018, and that's my signature Tokheim. The stoneware is then glazed. Next, it's put in a kiln that reaches up to 2,400 degrees. It takes 19 hours to heat it up and two days to cool it. Afterwards. This is one of our typical Scandinavian design bowls. It's Lucy's turn to add her personal touch. The cobalt will, will turn different colors in different parts of the kiln. The end result isn't just something that's pretty to look at but something that can actually be used. It's very durable, but it, you do need to not be clumsy. And it's not just pottery. The Tokheims have studied many forms of Norwegian art overseas. These are my uh, Norwegian style knives that I make by hand. Every day they are redesigning, trying to stay on the cutting edge of their crafts, all while hoping to inspire the next generation of artists. If they're really driven to do it, like I was, it was almost, I had to do it then I would say, you just go ahead and go for it. John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. Tokheim Stoneware is near Dawson, Minnesota on a country road. For more information, visit our website, wcco.com links.